Welcome to Sony Trends and Tips. Bob and I are here as your guides to the exciting world of new technology for consumers and for business. Today the topic is camcorders and Bob, what's on tap? You know, Joan, I just got a new camcorder with all the special features and I made up my mind that with this new Sony, I'm going to start taking some great videos. I mean, I have all this new technology at my fingertips and I want to take advantage of it. So, uh, how about giving me some pointers? Okay, well that's exactly what we have planned for today, Bob, because you're not alone. Many camcorder owners would like to shoot better videos, but they run into one or more of these five basic problems. Moving the camera too often, holding the camera on a crooked angle, panning or zooming too quickly, long static scenes where not enough is happening, and not identifying scenes adequately so you can identify them in the future. So, um, how do we solve these problems? Well, let's take them one by one and see. Okay. Okay, this is one of the most common video shooting problems. Too much camera movement. Mm. Well, it seems to me they're just, uh, they're trying to get everyone in the shot. Okay, well then, to do that, just step back a little and hold the camera still. Okay. Rule number one, hold the camera still. Next, there's the tilted camera syndrome. Now, this one's easy to correct. Before you start recording, Check carefully through your viewfinder. Then when you know you've got a level framing, start recording. Another sure way to keep the camera level is to use a tripod. And we'll cover that in a few minutes when we talk about useful accessories available for use with Sony camcorders. Joan, a lot of home videos I see seem to have too much zooming and panning, like this guy who's all over the place. Mm -hmm. Yeah, looks too busy, doesn't it? Exactly. Okay, well this is a situation where less is more. You know, just an occasional pan, maybe every seven or eight takes, is really the way professionals shoot. And for both pans and zooms, slow and steady is the way to go. You know, no fast or jerky moves. For example, this zoom into a close-up is a perfect example of controlled zooming. And notice the scene ends on the close-up. It's best not to zoom in or out or vice versa. Mm, okay. Now, for panning, sometimes you simply want to change the view from here to here. Okay, well then don't pan. Frame this scene and shoot at five seconds. Then stop, frame the next scene, and record. Hold the scene for only five seconds. That seems pretty quick. Well, unless there's some specific ongoing action you want, five seconds per scene is a reliable rule of thumb for good results. For example, this camcorder has a five second recording function which automatically stops the camera after five seconds. Recording this way helps you produce a fast-paced series of scenes that are fun to watch. Which brings up a good point. I've sat through some home videos that seem to go on forever. What's a good length for a video? Actually, Bob, five to ten minutes is really about the maximum. After that, you're in danger of boring your audience. Always leave them wanting more, huh? Exactly. And as a final point, make sure you and your audience know what they're looking at. Identify your scenes right at the start with a landmark or a sign or by having someone talk right into the camera or even create your own sign boards. This is a fun way to recall where you've been. <laughs> like a good reporter. You tell them who, what, where, when, and why. Mm -hmm. Good advice. And now that I know what it takes to make great videos, I want to learn all about these great accessories. Welcome to the Sony Gallery of Visual Imagery. I would like to take this opportunity to congratulate you on your purchase of your new Sony Handycam. You have now taken the first step in creating exciting, entertaining, and memorable home videos. We at Sony want to make your home video making as rewarding as possible. In the next few minutes, we are going to show you some of the exciting new accessories that Sony has to offer. The first thing that we need to talk about is batteries. One of the biggest frustrations home video makers face is running out of battery power. Nobody wants this to be the memory of their child's first steps. Sony offers you a number of options in its family of info lithium batteries with stamina power. The NP-F550 gives you up to four hours of continuous recording time. The NP-F750 gives you eight hours and the NP-F950 gives you up to 12 hours of continuous recording, all on one spare battery. All of Sony's InfoLithium batteries have a built-in microprocessor, the brain, that actually communicates information back and forth from your camcorder to let you know how much power you have left with an accuracy within minutes. In addition, 
No matter how often you charge your battery after a short use, the Infolithium battery will be fully charged and ready to go with no memory effect, discharge, or reduction of battery life. And speaking of charging, Sony has a few options for you here, too. The AC V700 is for home use, while the DC V700 is for the road and plugs right into your car's 12-volt power outlet. Both chargers employ the quick charge feature, which allows you to charge all of your info lithium batteries faster than any other way. They can charge up to a full hour of recording time in just 15 minutes. These Sony chargers have a built-in LCD panel that displays the time left to full and normal charge, as well as the remaining battery life in minutes. They even have a buzzer that notifies you when charging is complete. As you can see, Sony has given you some great options here. The important thing to remember is to choose the right spare battery for your videotaping needs. Here's a great accessory for your Sony Night Shot equipped Handycam, the HVL IRH Infrared Emission Light. With it, your night videos can go from this to this. With a Night Shot light, you can see further in zero light conditions. The HVL IRH light extends Sony's Night Shot feature from 10 feet to up to 100 feet with an infrared emission light. And since the HVL IRH is also a video light, it's like getting two lights in one. However, if you have a cold shoe accessory camcorder, Sony offers the HVL IRC Night Shot light, which requires an extra battery and does not include the video light capability. Choosing the right accessory not only makes your videos more enjoyable, but sometimes it can actually save the situation. Take a look at this. <laughs> look at the dog. With a Sony wide-angle conversion lens, you never have to leave anything out of the picture. And with a Sony telephoto lens and ECM HS1 microphone, you can focus right in on the really important information. Using the Sony VCT-570RM tripod with a remote control and a grip to control zoom, record, start-stop, and lock standby not only makes your shots steady and firm, but with the quick release you can get right into the action whenever you need to. With all of these great accessories, you are definitely going to need something to carry and protect your Handycam. Sony offers the LCS VA1 soft carrying case. With its compact design, it is made for most Sony Handycam camcorders. Its attractive black simulated leather and padding protect your valuable video equipment. It's an easy to carry shoulder bag with plenty of extra storage for all of your new Sony accessories. Well, by now you've taken some great home videos, but Sony's accessories don't stop there. You'll still want to watch these visual masterpieces, and Sony has several accessories that make that experience easier and more enjoyable. Gone are the days of fumbling through the cable jungle to hook your camcorder to your TV. With Sony's IFT R10A laser link receiver, you can play back your videos from your Handycam camcorder without any wire connections from up to 16 feet. And if you can't wait to get home to see your works of art, Sony has the GV A500 Video Walkman. We hope that you have enjoyed our short tour of the exciting world of visual imagery brought to you by Sony. There are numerous options out there, but remember, every great home video director has to start somewhere. To get you started on your way, Sony offers the ACC Kit F550 Starter Kit. It includes all the accessories necessary to start taking great and memorable videos. Videos that are easy to shoot and fun to watch. Remember, if you use some of the accessories and tips that we have shown here, you will be on your way to taking better and more enjoyable videos. If you would like to purchase any of these accessories or require any additional information, contact your local Sony retailer, visit our website, or call Sony toll-free at 888-965-SONY. Thanks for joining us.